All right, look at these two goofballs. I know, right? We got Junk Man and we got Freeze Man. Now the question is, Chaz, out of these two, which would you pick? All right, well, first rocks. Let's let's go Freeze Man. Nope, Junk Man. All right, Junk Man it is. He's Whoa. got two different color eyes. There's a term for that. I think it's uh, hetero. It's it's something cornea. Oh, yeah. It's like hypocornea or something. Like that. I don't remember. I don't know. I can't think of it right now. Oh no! You lost the thing. It's fine. There's a, those are worth like ten screws, and I just got another one. So he's got cockroaches and stuff. Yeah, he design. does have cockroaches. It's it's fun. It's fun for the whole family. I'm getting hit like you no know, tomorrow. Oh, Anyways, man. so. We got Junk Man. Junk Man, as you can tell, he's all about the junk. He's got he's got junk for days. He's Trash Man. He is Trash Man or Dust Man or whatever. We actually actually this is very reminiscent of a previous Mega Man Robot Master that we had to fight. Yeah. He's Trash. Dude. He's a Trash Man in Trash. Garbage man. Day. <laughs> Garbage Day. <laughs> That's a pretty fitting reference, right? Yes. Uh, by the way, oh, I'm not nice. sure entirely, because I've never been dumb enough to fall into lava, but I'm pretty sure lava is a one-hit KO. Well, the items don't die in it. <laughs> to go in it. You're right, the items don't die, but I do. Now, this Eight. is a prime example of a weapon actually doing something to a stage. Mm. Which is kind of neat. I actually like this. It, it, I like the fact that you can actually have a lot more interactivity with the stage that you get going in. Uh, something to note that's really unfortunate and a large reason why you actually have to backtrack into stages is we can't get the card to this stage. Oh no! But we can't find a secret Thing to get in the stage. We got a collectible. You want to take a guess at what that collectible was? Was that the fire gun? It was not the fire gun. Actually, if you want to know what it really was... It was Rush Jet. It Ooh, was Rush even Jet. better. That's right, even we had better. to find our stuff. Oh also, this God, thing. It heck? looks like the thing from Star Wars. It does. Uh... Fun thing to note, you can actually use this and bam, you get magnets. Interesting. Magnets are pretty, pretty dope, I have to say. Uh, I also have to say fucking magnets, how do they work? And I don't want to talk to no ah! scientists. Your, your motherfuckers are lying and gave me piss. It, it was a fitting reference. I don't it care what anybody says. Oh my god, these helicopter boys need to move. You know, you know what's what's kind of sad? I used to fear oh, ICP, mad. now I think they're hilarious. Those guys are mad when trash gets on them. Yeah, they are, well, I don't think they like wait. That That was a dick move. Great. I don't have time for winding powers, so I really have to. I I actually have to do this legitimately. Yeah. <laughs> that was the dickest move ever. How far back did you end up? That's pretty far back. Yeah, it is. I I was really close to actually beating the whole entire stage. If you can believe that. Do you need to get the um thing again? No, no, actually, if you look in my menu, uh, which the viewers probably did, you can pause it at that section, I actually still have the rush jet, so that still stays in my inventory. It's it's a one and done, as they say. So how do you do this without the electricity? You just kind of... Rush coil. Oh. That, that is the best advice I have for anybody. Also, I have to say, be careful about that last slip section, because I feel like you will easily get crushed, if nothing else. You get turned into Mega Man juice. You know, I got a feeling you can actually do this, and uh, it, it's pretty viable. Except if you do that, which kind of You tell them the garbage. You know what? I just had some weird inspiration to just say, fuck it.
Oh. Oh, Henry. Why would Henry do that to you? I don't know. Maybe because I'm a stupid dumb dumb. Anyways, we're back. We're back to the part where I died. Um, Ooh, that guy. You know, I've never had an O. Henry. Um, they're all right, I guess. That's kind of the the feeling I had going into an O. Henry. Like, I don't know anyone who's like, oh yes, O. Henry is my favorite candy. So. S same with like bitter honey. Oh my like, god, who, it was who, bit of honey that I was thinking of. Like, who the heck wants a bit of honey? I, I actually have no opinion of O. Henry because I got it mixed up with a bit of honey. They're base, Aren't they like the same thing? I can't even remember. I don't even remember! Uh, this this is Junkman, by the way. He's so ridiculously he easy. I love his goofy, cartoonish... Like, oh! <laughs> his eye pops out of his eye. <laughs> it's funny, it's cartoonish. Oh my god, he Also, died he quick. goes down like a chump. That's, that's, that's how you fight chump, man. I don't care what anyone says legitimately. I'm gonna, I'm gonna roll mega bust run. Fuck you. Fuck you. I'm not that skilled. I'm gonna do this the way any average Joe would do it. By cheat. I am that. He gives us a junk shield. It's like any other barrier ability you would have in any of the Mega Man games, you now, know what I'm saying? Now, here's a here, here's a here's a little thing I have to bring up. Because, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, what was so bad about, you know, showing off the power and then you got weapon thing. Why do we have to see Mega Man ask a stupid question and that then Dr. Wario go... No, yeah, I don't mean to cut you that. off, but that is a brilliant thought, because it's just like, exclamation mark, Chaz, you are so right. Uh, I liked Mega Man 6 when they did that, because it gave you a little preview of what's going to happen when you use the power-up, which is really crucial for the player, because you're going to know what you're up against. No, exactly. instead, they're just like, hey, Dr. Light, here's my power. What does it do? Here's a long explanation of how to properly use the power. That doesn't tell me how to use the power up. That tells me, oh, he, let's talk about it. I want to talk about it. I want to know how to do it. I don't care. I, there's too much talking in this game. Actually, you want to know what's even... Freeze, man. Let me just get started, because, you know, we're going to be telling you Freeze, man. Now, but, out of all the... Robot Masters, he's the coolest looking so far, but... <laughs> yeah, see what you did there. Uh, I actually kind of oh, like his theme. I, I but... kind of like his theme. Uh, I was going to say... Uh... <sighs> Sorry. I got caught in two thoughts. Um, oh my god, it's a polar bear. Thing. It is a polar bear. He's going to swipe a little ice uh, chunk uh, at you. Uh, but... So, so your thought actually is going to screw... So, actually, it screwed me over, not being able to know how to use the power properly, because I, there is something super crucial to knowing how to actually do something, and I didn't know how to do it, because I was like, well, I don't know how to use the power properly. They probably talked about it, but again, no kid's gonna care about what Dr. Light and Mega Man are talking about. I care about actually being able to use my power, you know what I'm saying? They're not even saying anything useful either. They're like, oh, that you. It's like Yu Gi Oh! or Pokemon when they're talking about the elemental weaknesses. But it's like any kid knows about elemental weaknesses. You know, I understand. Fire is gonna wreck grass. I don't need to go to school to learn about, like, elemental weaknesses in Pokemon. If I. If mm. anything, explain IVs. Yeah. See, I Maybe have basic nice. knowledge on this shit. I'm not completely dumb. These things suck, by the way. But you also yeah, need them. That's what really sucks about them. They're temporary platforms in order to get I through difficult situations. I see that. Shield Boy's back. Yeah, Shield Boy's suck. He's been he's been in the game forever. He has. Well, different variations, I would say. Yeah. All right. So clearly, you know what's up. You gotta go up or down. 
Now the problem is, I might have to cheat. Not in the way that you think. And I'm uh, more in the way of, I might have to cut until I get that. What's, hard, what's so hard about it? Those platforms crumble. I did it oh. so I can actually show you what why. Oh, you did it so well. Yeah, I did it. I did it. So I was what, I was what, afraid I wasn't, down. but those crumble. Now you the reason why the that stairs. doesn't seem like a big deal is because uh you think they, no, they respond, but they don't. They don't. Oh. That's that's why I would have had to restart the part or not the part. I would have had to go here, go to a load checkpoint. Right. I don't. <laughs> That's why I would have had you cheat, but I, I don't have to. Good job. I'm sure you worked very hard. Now I, I, I did practice. I did practice. I wanna, I wanna re-emphasize, despite the fact I am, I'm a little intoxicated. I'm a little, a little under the influence. I did practice. Part of what's getting me through all this is the fact that I have an idea of what's, what's up. Now here's a interesting anecdote here um bazooka joe there ooh a rush thing you're right sorry bazooka joe bazooka joe while he looks awesome he has a big old tell now when he's about to shoot his eye flashes you're right no he didn't used to have that you just kind of had to guess while you explain that i'm going to show off the rush search surge search Go rush search. I have a search. slur. I'm sorry. Go search, dog. It it. This is pretty much what happens when you just use it. That or he actually digs up and you get some trash. Occasionally, you'll actually get something semi useful, like a like a drop from any normal pal like any normal enemy. So that's by far the worst rush power up yet. It's not. It's not, despite the fact that you think, eh, it's okay. It's it's actually not that bad. It's just, it's just, it could be better. Ooh, this one's big. This he one, it's not big. It's just right he has a ceiling, so he can do that extra thing. And I, I guess my point is, he's guarding an E tank, and I want it. Yeah, I would want it too. So he makes a small roaring sound. It's 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 very it's very not what I would think this guy would make. Uh, I would expect him to go like. Rrr, rrr. I would expect him to make something bigger, but I feel like the capabilities of this nest only allow him to do that. Now, I will say this: the rust search will help you. It will actually get you some really good shit. The problem is. You have to know where to get it. I like to say I actually legitimately know how to use this properly. The rush like, or, sorry. sorry. I'm trying not to fall on the spikes. I'm trying to legitimately do this the way. But see, here's the thing. That happens every time I try to do that. The pro the placement of this ladder is absolute garbage. It's stupid. It's stupid. You gotta use the rush coil in order to really utilize what is necessary to get to that ladder. It's dumb. But I'll tell you what's hilarious as opposed to dumb. This segment. Those things... Jamaican bobsled team? Kinda. Here's the thing. <laughs> I, I really want to show off when... Yeah, yeah. That face <laughs> oh my is God. absolutely... It's, it's... <laughs> oh man, that face is worth a million dollars. I don't care what anybody says. That is, that is the that makes my day every day. Oh my god, those things are great. <laughs> I just like when they explode. It's like, oh shit! <laughs> uh, so, as I was trying to say about Rush Search, I like to say I legitimately know when to use it. I didn't. I looked it up. I did cheat. I'm cheating when I use it. So here. So he barks. He barks. Bark, he does that bark. one fright scene when he when there's something good. What's he getting? What you got, boy? An exit. This is the exit module at the store. Oh. Just, no, just to, to prove. For it. See, see. Now, yes. whenever I go into a level, I can leave it. Had, a... <laughs> granted, I beat 
the robot master. So if I re-enter a level and there's something good, like, say I miss that exit module. Yeah. I can go back into the level, use rush search to find said thing, get it, and then exit the level. Ha granted, I beat the robot master. Right. And so, I need to beat, uh... Freeze Man. Ice Free Mr. Freeze. Mr. Freeze. Ooh! But I haven't oh mentioned God. it. Look at the background. That is hilarious. Robot that dinosaur is on ice. Alright, he's definitely the coolest of all the robot masters so far. <laughs> I saw what you did there. I mean he definitely is. Like everything about his level and him. So cool. I, I I do like the fact that I kinda got to show off what he does. And I didn't die, so I got to show off what he does as well as live. He freezes and the jump. ground, which gives you ice momentum, so that sucks. Also, he creates icicles on the ceiling, which fall at you, and that also sucks. And then he runs into you and hits you like a truck, that also sucks. But he gives the you the freeze, freeze cracker. cracker. fires ice bullets, doesn't it? Yeah. Well, yeah. here's the thing. Uh, sorry to break the immersion, but here's the thing. Freeze cracker sounds so racist. Like, 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 imagine, like, like, it sounds like something police would say to a white man. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, here's the password, everybody. That is the password. Derpy boy roll. Now we get plot, scared. we get plot, everyone. Plot. I don't care about the plot. I don't play Mega Man for Welcome plot. home, Mega Man. Dark and light, what do you think of base? Or is it pass? How low can you go? No, it's bass, it's bass. It's a musical theme, but... What do you think of pass? He bass. seems alright, Mega Man, but honestly... We have to worry about Dr. Wiwi. How low can you go? Death Row? Uh, what, what, what is this? Dr. Wiwi's attacking Robot Museum. Oh no! We must leave now, Mega Man. So, fun fact. Dr. Wily's castle. You notice how in the background you see that, that Brainiac Maniac thing? The thing that you shoot yeah. once and it freaks out on the pillar yeah. and then lo and behold, you have, you have mentals. Yeah. Also, that thing up there. that That's an enemy we fought. I don't remember which Mega Man game. If someone wants to comment below, I'll, I'll give it's full like a... credit to. Uh, I'm yeah. not going to list you in the video, but you get full credit. I yeah. know that's in one of the Mega Man games. Also, hey, Snake, look, Snake Man, Man, Blizzard Man. Uh, -oh. uh, I don't remember Man, Heat Man. Uh, look in the background. We got Flame Man, and I think Plant Man. Was that was that uh no? Is that Tomahawk? Oh, that is Flame Man. Okay. Yeah, I think that's Plant Ooh. Man in the background. Is that Gemini Man right there? Who? Behind Snake Man. This guy? Oh no 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 no! You no no! Plant Man's Man. behind Gemini Man. Okay, or Snake. Okay. Hey, we're Capcom. We used to make good games. No, they still make g good games. We used to make good Mega Man games. They, they still do <laughs> make good Mega Man games. Not also, I, I don't remember these oh, two. I don't remember God. those two, but that's Gusman. Um. That's Gusman. Is that Skull Man? I think that is Skull Man. I don't remember and who the, the one that says right is. Top? That's not Top Man, is it? I thought it was Top Man. I don't think so. So he turned Gutsman into a clown. No, this isn't Gutsman. This is... God help me, I don't even know what the fuck this thing is. It's like a jester. He sucks, though. He's fat and spins around. He sucks. His pattern sucks. I remember the first time I fought him, it was... It was... It was really painful. Because he... Basically, his body... Blocks everything. So what's his weakness? Just Mega Buster? I don't even know. All I found is it, it's easier to shoot him and then try to just avoid him. Basically, you'll get about two shot or two hits, and then you might be able to actually do do the thing. Um, he he he's a real pain in the butt though. I, I don't like him. I don't like him. I might actually use an oh. E-Tank just because I, I oh, need I to survive. Either. I hate him. I, I do too! He's not funny! 
He's supposed to be like a Harley Quinn thing, a fat Harley Quinn. That sounds hilarious. He's not hilarious. He makes me sad. He makes me want to die. Also, you can't hit him when his head is flipping. You have to, you have to wait until, until it like. Why does his head bounce like directly at you? Because he's a dick. Like, how do you control? You can't control your head. You can't, but he finds a way to make it happen. You know how you know how I'm struggling. That, yeah, that's that's really. that's this battle in a nutshell. That's Mega Man Seven, everybody. You know how I'm struggling. That's Mega Man Seven. I hate to say it, but that's really that that's them's the breaks. That's how I feel about Mega Man Seven, everybody. If I, if I can get one more shot, I win. If I cannot use an E-Tank, I win. Get I him. did it! And he- I did it! I did He's it! He's dead. I did it. Good job, killed him. I'm patting my head. He's dead. He dead. deserves a- he deserves a swift- he, Oops, I knocked over my shot class. <laughs> it's a day as you make, what man. A what is he rampaging through the middle of the city? <laughs> Dr. Dr. Light, you, you're drunk. Go home. Go home, Dr. Light. He's pretty happy in that picture, though. Yeah. So now we get the proper- Oh, no. We get the robot real. masters. This <laughs> is just a test. Uh, right, Chaz. Can I guess their names? Do I get to guess their names too? In the next part. In the next part. Okay. We gotta end this part, but uh, yes, yeah. in the next part, I will let you try to guess their names. Okay. So, uh, this has been part two of Mega Man Seven. In the next yeah. part, we're gonna we're gonna figure out these other four robot masters. I got good maybe even one. retread one of them. Nope. Goodbye!